Sam. Cinderella was fond of ballet. She wanted to be a ballerina one day, so she shared her dream with the prince and she started attending the country's most famous ballet school. So, you're going to ballet school. This is great. Yes, Pofu. I really want to be a ballerina. I'm sure you'll be good at it. It'd be a pleasure to watch you perform. While Cinderella and Pofu were talking, Sarah was passing by. Ballet school? Where did this come from? There's always something new with her. Sarah immediately told the news to her witch mother, Rosa. Mm, ballet school, you say, huh? Everyone will love her. And once again, the prince will be smitten. Ugh, I don't like this girl. She's always successful at what she does. We're not going to sit around and wait for her to be praised. What do you mean? What are we going to do? You're going to that ballet school too. Yay! Yippee! Thanks, Mommy! Anyway, don't worry. Leave the dancing part to me. Cinderella was surprised to see Sarah at ballet school. Sarah, I didn't know you liked ballet. I'm a natural born ballerina, but I can't say the same about you. I doubt you're as talented as me. You haven't even seen me dance. Ha, we'll see. I'm not sure what Sarah's doing here. Don't pay any attention to her. The class began and Cinderella had no problem doing the poses. Bravo, Cinderella! You're amazing! However, Sarah was having a hard time. Bend down more! You can do it! Try harder! Uh, I can't do it! Oh, this is so hard! Ugh. Wow! Extraordinary! Oh, this can't be possible! Rosa and Sarah were unhappy seeing Cinderella succeed. This girl is really good. You'd better think about something now. While Cinderella gets praised, I'm embarrassed. Don't worry. Cinderella will be shamed at tomorrow's rehearsal. Mmm, what's your plan? The next day, Rosa and Sarah went to school early and plotted against Cinderella. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be in her place. There seems to be something odd with my shoes. They were not where I left them. Wait a minute. What is this? A thorn spell has been cast on my shoes. Thorn spell? What is that? It means that sharp thorns appear wherever the spell is cast. What's wrong, darling? Is there something wrong with your shoes? Let's see how Sarah performs. When the class started, Rosa's eyes were fixed on Cinderella. <laughs> the thorns will start to grow soon. Ouch! Something is pricking my feet! What's the matter? Sarah, what are you doing? <laughs> Girls, look at her! <laughs> Stay away! Leave me alone! The school management decided to expel Sarah because she had failed her classes. They're kicking me out of school. How come? They obviously think that you're not as good as the others. You must graduate from the school for the show and the palace. That's when something unexpected happened. Don't worry, I've got it. Sarah will continue attending school. You took care of it? Why? I don't get it. It wouldn't be nice for a member of the palace to be expelled from the school. Of course, they couldn't refuse a prince's request. 
Sarah didn't like school anyway, but since you insist, she'll keep attending. Finally, classes were over and the students received their certificate of achievement. That also included Cinderella and Sarah. I'm proud of you, Cinderella! All eyes would be on the ballet recital that the students had prepared to perform at the palace. Well done. You'll take part in the show at the palace. Are you sure about that? Certainly. The prince must see you. But what about Cinderella? She dances ballet superbly. This time she has no chance. I've been plotting the perfect plan. <laughs> Before the performance, the prince visited the ballet students and wished them good luck. Mum, what spell did you cast on the tea? Something that won't allow her to stand on her feet at the show. The students appeared on the stage and performed what they had rehearsed. Then it was Cinderella's turn. I'm not feeling well. I think that tea made me sick. I must cast a healing spell on myself to get better. Pofu, take care of things. I'll be right back. Dear audience, Cinderella will perform after she changes costume. I can't wait to see the show. We'll have so much fun. Happening. She's dancing wonderfully. This is strange. We should have seen the effect of my spell by now. The audience was spellbound by Cinderella's performance. Did you see how the prince was taken with her? So Sarah got on the stage. Unfortunately, things didn't go as she had hoped. What's happening to me? My head is spinning! Sarah, what did you do? You drank the wrong tea! Get off, Sarah! Get off! Yikes! Everything is spinning! Having magic powers can come in handy, Pofu. At least I can protect myself from those two witches. We can laugh at their expense, too. <laughs> Cinderella was so good at painting that her art aroused admiration. Amazing. Bravo! Amazing! Perfect! Perfect. Bravo! I didn't know you were so talented, Cinderella! Thank you, my dear Pofu! Only two people were not fond of her pictures. You didn't draw the trees correctly, and I don't think the colors are good either! I agree with my mother. I don't think you're a good painter. Never mind them, Cinderella. They're just jealous of your talent. I know, Pofu. Sarah and Rosa are just being snarky as usual. The girl's very talented. She was born to paint. I wish you had a little skill too. Uh-huh. I got that from who? A celebration would take place at the palace for the anniversary of the country's founding so an important exhibition will be displayed. Cinderella, did you hear? Paintings of the royal family will be on display. Is that so? But there's no painting of the prince yet. Will they find a better artist than you? Really? Do you think I can? Of course you can! If I had your talent, I wouldn't hesitate. 
So Cinderella got to work and started painting a portrait of the prince. Very good! Keep going! But this situation did not please Sarah and Rosa. What is this? Look at what she's doing! Cinderella is painting a portrait of the prince. This must be for the royal exhibition. This girl will definitely gain everyone's attention. Of course, Cinderella will get the prince's attention too. I hate her. Wait, if she has talent, then I have a great mind. <laughs> What's on that wicked mind of yours? Just tell me. You'll paint the prince's portrait, not Cinderella. But how? I can't even draw a rustic figure. Just trust me. Listen to me. Meanwhile, Cinderella was about to complete the prince's portrait. It is going very well. It will be beautiful once it's finished. I need to rest a little. Let's go out to the garden and take a walk. Sarah and Rosa entered the room stealthily when they saw Cinderella and Pofu leave. Oh, she did a good job. Will this really work? I worked hard on the spell. Now watch what happens. The prince disappeared from the painting. You are an amazing witch. <laughs> Come on, let's get out of here before anyone sees us. When Cinderella and Pofu returned to the picture in front of them, they could not believe their eyes. The prince disappeared from the painting! But how is that possible? I bet this was magic. I think Rosa and Sarah are behind all this. What are we going to do now? There's very little time for the exhibition. <laughs> They're baffled. <laughs> Let me remind you that I have magic powers too, my friend. This is great! What exists cannot be lost as long as you have the desire to bring it back. The picture is back! How is that possible? It seems that she used magic, but it's impossible! So she learned to do magic. This is not good. Still, she's not better than me. Let's go! Where are we going? This is not over yet. Cinderella did some more work on the prince's portrait and... <sighs> it's almost done. I'll finish the painting tomorrow, Pofu. Okay, see you tomorrow then. Good night. But Pofu couldn't sleep at all that night. I can't let go of the idea that Rosa and Sarah might be seeing something again. Pofu went to Cinderella's study room. I knew it! My suspicions were right! What if it doesn't work again? This time it will work. Her magic won't be able to counteract my spells. Huh? I'm glad I saw that. The next day, Pofu told Cinderella what she had witnessed in her studio. So they cast a spell on my paintings? Ugh! The picture turned out to be a disaster! So that's the new spell. Let's do our own trick. What do you say? Rosa and Sarah were curious. Let's go check it out. It will be hilarious. It worked. <laughs> no time to make a new one. Now it's your turn. Okay, but how do I paint? I can't even hold a brush properly. You won't have to do anything. My magic brush will paint for you. 
but someone was watching them. Sarah's going to paint the prince's portrait with Rose's magical brush. So let's give them a taste of their own medicine. was about to paint on her canvas. What should I do? Dip the magic brush into the paint and draw on the canvas. The paintbrush will handle the rest. Wow, it worked! This is awesome! Sarah immediately showed her painting to the king and prince. I painted the portrait of our prince for the exhibition. I hope you like it. My picture! It can't be! What happened to my painting? It can't be! This is Cinderella's doing! We are disgraced! The royal exhibition finally opened and the portrait of the prince painted by Cinderella was displayed. Everyone praised it. 